Hello, my dear friends, and welcome. First of all, thank you so very much for stopping by. Thank you for watching my channel, Ivan Atero. This is weekly tarot prediction for zodiac sign Aquarius for new upcoming week, December 10th until December 16th. My dear friends, you can see all the display in front of my camera. This is your work department. In a couple of minutes, I will reshuffle my cards and then I will talk about what you can expect in your love department, whether you are single or already attached. Okay, so my dear Aquarius, the very first tarot card is Disruption. Basically, this tarot card is Major Arcana, the Tower. Obviously, this is a jeopardy of some kind, challenge, maybe something that you need to go through. This is also test, test of time. Maybe simply, this is you saying, I am ready for my retirement. If you are in a certain, you know, ages. Maybe you do not want to proceed with your current job. You know, this is also test. This is also test of initiation. Do you know where you're heading? Do you know what type of job you want or you would like to do? Maybe you are just one step before you will find your truthful purpose. Purpose. So this is like awakening tarot card. But since this is disruption or major account of the tower, this awakening sometimes could be rude. This probably is some unexpected event, probably not very nice one, but guys, listen to me. There is a purpose for everything. So just look around, because probably one door will be closed and then another door will be opened. But this transition or disruption is never easy to cope with. So, change is in front of you. Test of do you know what basically you need to do in your life. Probably with this tarot card you will discover talent that probably you never knew that you have inside of you. So guys, guys, just remember, there is a reason why some things are happening in specific time, precisely in this time in your life. The very next tarot card is King of Swords. And before I proceed, maybe this is not about you. Maybe this is about your partner. Maybe this is something happening in your family. And still... This tarot card could show a fear that you have inside of you. But since I'm experienced as a tarot reader and as a woman, as a human being, I know because I learned my lesson every single time. After upheaval of any kind, you will get a clarity. So King of Swords is exactly what it is. You will be forced to think so fast because you need to save yourself. And this is exactly what it is. King of Swords. Tarot card of the truth. King of Swords. When someone might push you. And by the way, this is your tarot card. This is Libra, Gemini and also you. Aquarian. So you want to know the truth. This is you insisting. This is you, you really insist. I want to know the truth. I heard some rumors. What is happening in our company? You know, or maybe some of you, maybe even you will resign. Or simply this is you preparing for some shift or some change because you maybe want to make this change. But just remember, you have what it takes. Whether you know that this very second or maybe not. 
you are described as very intelligent person but this is like a test of your intelligence and this is like test of initiation how fast you can act you can act in unpredictable any kind of circumstances the next eroka is justice so karma have no menu you will find your place you will be probably rewarded for something and i think this is some words or some thoughts or some skill or some knowledge that basically you possess justice or karma tarot card will put you where basically you belong so nothing you should be you know worried about so this tarot card will put you in a balance this tarot card will help you to find your truthful, rightful place where you really do belong when it comes to almost your general life, but also this could be connected with your job, your business and responsibility in general. All in all, this spread I can feel is connected with dignity saying, I don't deserve that. I deserve something better or more. And obviously you are ready and yeah, ready and prepared you know to fight for your better future this is basically the message and then Ace of Pentacles new opportunity and new offer bad offer so this is offer this is money clouds out of the blue green like a fresh new start and a path this path is a narrow but you will find your path and this is basically the most important message you will find this street or place or job where truthfully basically you do belong now let me reshuffle for a couple of seconds my tarot cards before i start reading for your love life love love department let me put it like that whether you are single or attached let me see my dear aquarians what is happening what is happening with you okay so the very first tarot card is emotional loss ouch how come probably this is you trying to forget about someone obviously you are dealing with some pain with some emotional loss this is you probably still in the process of grieving trying to let go of memory of you know someone some of you are in despair you really really think that everything is lost in your life you really think that you lost someone for good i don't know i need to open another four ten cards that i will know so probably not all of you but some of you are in a depression you really try to mend your heart but for some of you probably will be very very hard to do that you know because every single story always goes vice versa for so many aquarians this could be your current partner maybe even ex or your current partner thinking or being already you know scared of losing you can you see this person man of woman okay excuse me fell down okay excuse me okay so this is like you or your partner holding so tightly uh to heart so someone is trying you know to protect heart this could be you but this also could be your partner so you know this loss doesn't have to be yours you know maybe you just talk with your partner saying you know please you know uh, give me some credit, you know, please don't take me you know, for granted, you know, because you might lose me, you, you might lost me, lose me, you know, so this is, this is a pain, this is a pain, I don't know guys, if this is you dealing with Cancer, Pisces or Scorpio, maybe this is your pain inside of you, maybe you are really afraid that you might lose your partner, okay, let me see, the next tarot card is five of swords okay so five of swords this is like you know battle is over 
and you need to deal with the consequences. Five of Swords, somebody is leaving. Guys, maybe this is you leaving. Probably you are not ready to fight anymore for your territory because you have enough of pains. Whatever you say, nothing is worth, nothing makes sense anymore, you know. So also you are so uh, devastated, you know, and, and basically you're worn out, you know. You do not want, uh, you know, uh, to walk on the egg, you know, on, on eggshell, you know, kind of, you are, you know, why you don't want to listen to me, you know, can I say at least, you know, something, why you do not want to listen to me anymore. So guys, you can see on this tarot card, someone is leaving, maybe this is you trying to say something, or maybe this is your partner, maybe your partner wants to say something to you, but you are not ready to listen anymore. This battle, this fight is over, probably for you. And there are some casualties, some consequences, you know. So maybe this is the end, but I have three more tarot cards to come. So we will see how the story will develop. By the way, this is also Gemini and Libra tarot card. The next tarot card is Major Arcana the Hermit. Take your time. Do not rush. Because Major Arcana the Hermit, this is like the Hermit mode of waiting and, you know, being ready for final discussion, you know, the, for final, uh, you know, maybe even making a compromise. But this is you saying, no, I ain't gonna call him. No, 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 no. If he decides to call me, okay, we can talk, but I ain't gonna call this person uh, no more. And this is all about value. This is just searching you know, from inside should I give another opportunity to this person or maybe I should leave forever? One day you are so very peaceful, another day you are very nervous, one day you are ready for conversation, another day you are not ready for conversation. This is a quest. You want to understand what happened, what your partner basically want from you. Next tarot card is Major Arcana Temperance, which talks about healing. But both those two tarot cards are saying, do not rush. By the way, this is Virgo and this is Sage. So those two tarot cards both are talking about healing, healing yourself, trying to find purpose, and value, you know, how much you really love and value this person next to you. So many of you, if you are single, you are so, uh, you know, angry and you feel this tarot card probably, uh, you know, the most, you know, kind of, you know, I will never fall in love, you know, again, you know, I do not want to be with, like, with nobody, nobody understands me. There is like nobody which is good, you know, for you. This is basically, you know, your thoughts. You can see your thoughts are completely, you know, crashed. So guys, someone is coming. And this tarot card is always, always a talking, you know, that you need to go inside of you. And this person who is either in your life or soon might come in your life, this person will be like a doctor like psychiatrist, psychology, like a remedy, you know, for your soul. Your soul is devastated. Your soul is devastated. Your soul is ruined. This is your, uh, you know, cry for a help, but not with your words. More like this is you crying from inside of you. And you really think nobody is hearing me. Nobody is loving me. The whole white world is like a desert. There is no love. There is no good, you know, people. But guys, just a couple of hours or even a couple of days and the answer is coming. The answer finally is coming. This is you mending your heart. This is also protect from your guardian angel. 
you will finally understand, you know, fulfillment, love, what you should do next. And by the way, this is someone who is like lost like you are. But this person has a way how to mend your heart and forever. Wait. Simply wait. So many of you have two or maybe even more options. But probably none of those two options is like good for you. And this is you saying, no, no, no. I do not want to deal with people who are superficial. I ain't gonna give you know, my love, my heart to nobody who is not on your level, on your energetical level. So be patient because I think that either you already know who this person is, could be Aquarian, could be Libra, could be Gemini, probably also could be Cancer, Virgo or Sag. This person who is like, you know, made to be with you. But you know, guys, what the thing is? The thing is, you ain't gonna call like nobody. This is you saying, no more indulge other people. I have enough of that. So a lot of pain inside of you. But also Queen of Swords is saying clarity is coming. Person who is completely clear. But this also could be your current uh, partner. Maybe even someone from your uh, past. Someone who will finally give you a clarity. How much this person loves you or how much this person loved you. So clarity of your thoughts, clarity of your heart is coming. So let me conclude like this. You need to wait. You need to be patient. And you need to break down walls that you built around you. You are a very private person now. And even I can see you avoiding social events. So this tarot card is saying, please don't do that. Come back to the people. And the answer, love answer, is coming shortly to you. So there you go, guys. This is your message. If you want to hear your private story, book a private reading with me. In the meantime, make sure to subscribe on my channel, like and share this video with your friends. God bless you all.